going back to school with that. Ooh. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. <laughs> What's up guys? What's up friends? What's up YouTube? You're watching Armani Sloan. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Ooh. If I'm being real with y'all, I don't really know how to act in front of the camera right now just because like it's been so long. But today is a very special day because I am going back to school. I am finally, finally, finally going back to school. I don't know if you guys have known, but I've been in a gap year for like a while now like it ended up being more than a year but um I'm going back to school I've been in pretty much a gap year and I just like am excited like my heart is like beating so fast I'm like out of breath like but I'm nervous but like I'm excited but like I'm kind of scared because the campus is so big but also like it's lit happy new year you guys happy 2023 I think the videos that I post from this point forward are going to be kind of like sporadic so I'll probably start out by posting this video but I will let you guys know that um the videos that I kind of filmed before I stopped like recording I'm gonna be putting some of those up too because I kind of got some bangers in like it's some bangers in there first day of school first day at UCF we finally did it we were about to get the bag and we are about to get the degree so let's go see you guys soon we're done getting ready i'm just going with a tank top and some black jeans these are actually black rose jeans i don't know if you guys can see them i'm not wearing the crocs so don't be trying to roast me i'm gonna put some vans on and wear it with this and i'm also gonna bring a jacket because who about to be cold like the weather has been a little weird but also um i'm pretty sure the classrooms are cold like schools be doing students dirty with like cold classrooms like antarctica classrooms so <laughs> So I'm gonna have like probably a jean jacket to go with this. But yeah, we are ready. We're ready to tackle the day. Um, before I eat, I'm just gonna take some vitamins real quick. Today is Monday, so I am gonna take out the Monday tab. <sighs> Believe it or not, I feel like I more recently learned how to swallow pills. Don't judge me. Oh, OTD once again. The rose jeans are really a vibe. Like, they really are. And then I'm not wearing the Crocs, so don't judge me. Okay. I am about to make something to eat, and I'm about to do the Dizzy Dash. But I am just, like, thinking about this past year and like how I just haven't been recording for real. And it's really the way that like, I really could have made a couple movies for y'all. And I'm so mad. Like I got so sidetracked. It's crazy to me. But you know, we back, we back with it. I, I feel like I'm living a little more regularly now though. So it's like, <laughs> I don't know what type of content I'll be putting out. Like I know I'm gonna get school content out. Uh, I know I'm going to be hanging out here and there, but uh, I'm just wondering like what type of content that I'll be like putting out now. I don't know. These are just like little oatmeal bites. I'm about to warm these up and have some tea real quick. Uh, uh. They're like apple cinnamon, like little, they're almost, I don't know, they're like oatmeal bites. They kind of look ugly, but like they kind of don't, I don't know. Not the Christmas decorations and stuff still up. <laughs> um, what was I about to say? I've been trying to eat healthier. So that is where the oatmeal bites come from. Mm. They don't have too much sugar in them. I actually made them from scratch. I just got done eating my like breakfast for the day. I'm actually about to head to the library. 
Um, I'm gonna bring a few snacks with me. So I have like this skinny pop right here. I'm gonna throw it in a bag. Um, I bought these fruit snacks today. They're like these green tea Arizona fruit snacks. I'll let you guys know how they are. And then I just have like this like sweet and salty granola bar. Throw it in a bag, we gotta go. In my bag I also have, I just threw my snacks in there, just a few school supplies, a planner, pens, pencils, binder, I don't know if you guys can see all that. And then I also am gonna put my computer in here, in its sleeve of course. Ain't nobody got time to be like running around here with like a low key naked MacBook. Hey, what it do? Hey, what it do? Actually headed to the library right now. It's giving college baddie. What college baddie? It's giving very much that. But yeah, like I was like trying to find the parking garage. Like I've been to this campus like a hundred times. And I was trying to find the parking garage, and then I found the one I wanted to park in, but then it was full, so I had to come to another one. I guess this is like first day jitters. Just like not knowing what is going on. Like really though, right now, am I even going to the library for real? <laughs> I think I know where it is, but we're gonna we're gonna find out today. But yeah, and like I was driving around too. There's so many people here. Like I I know UCF is like the largest university in this country, but I really like underestimated how many people like are here right now. So, I don't know. I don't know. Ooh, I'm like a little nervous, but like I waited for this day. So like, nervous who, you know? If I'm being real, I don't even think I really know how to act. Like I'm just soaking it all in. Oh, there's my little college. I'm just soaking it all in. And like, honestly, I don't want people to like hear me <laughs> say this, cause like hella people around, but like, I'm really at a university right now. Like what? I always wondered what it'll be like, and it's like, oh my god, I'm finally here.
Okay, I'm a little out of breath, but that's okay. I just wanted to come on here and say that if you guys couldn't tell by now, I am a journalism major. I know I kind of showed y'all my classes a little bit earlier, but yeah, I'm a journalism major and my track, which is like the specific to that major is electronic news. I hope to go into like entertainment reporting. So yeah, we are out of the library, back into the parking garage. And I'm just gonna go home really quickly, eat real quick and come back to the night class because I didn't want to like stay on campus, you know? Like I didn't want to stay on campus for all of that time and then be here until like, what, 1.30, 2 o'clock to 9. So that was gonna be doing too much. I'm gonna go home real quick, eat and come back, do my night class and then come back home. I know that sounds like a lot of back and forth, but like I need to feed myself. And I'm not about to eat on campus because who y'all finna charge a million dollars to eat? So every time I've been to campus, it has never been this much traffic. Like right now, I don't know if I should leave, but I'm gonna try. Like, I'm gonna try. Cause I don't live that far. But, um, yeah, this traffic is bad. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know if, like, the class times are this. I don't, I don't know. I feel like class times are just too different, you know? Like, I don't feel like everybody's class time is the same for the traffic to be like, oh, everybody's leaving at the same time. But I, yeah, like, this traffic is kinda doing the most. No lie. I don't know if y'all can like even see it, but it's not cute. It's not cute. Oh my gosh, I'm in the ghetto. Wow. Wow, I'm in the ghetto. Bro, let me say this. My like apartment complex does not make being in a rush ever like a convenient. The parking here, bro. Bro. I'm about ready to pack a box and go. I'm not even playing. Like, I'm not even playing. Like, my unit is all the way on the other side of the property, and <laughs> I'm, like, damn near at the top of the parking garage, which is not, like, the worst, like, you know what I mean? But, and don't let me be coming home late from work. It's definitely over with then. It is what it is, but I'm about to chat down real quick and go to class, because who finna be up at, who finna be on campus hungry? Not me. I'll show y'all what I eat in just a sec. I didn't catch this on camera, but when I was in the library, I met a person that likes to do YouTube. And like, I had my camera sitting on the table. And so he was like, oh, are you a YouTuber? I'm like, yeah, but I'm small. Like, I don't know. And then YouTube is also different than TikTok. Like if I want to, for real, I could take on TikTok, but like YouTube is kind of like, it's like a world that I have not figured out yet. Okay, I just whipped something up real quick. Don't judge me though, cause it kind of looks <laughs> Where is my phone so I can keep track of time? I got about mm, 10, 15 minutes now. It looks kind of jacked up because I left the tortilla in the oven for a little too long and I got tortillas that are too big but it's basically a fish taco and just like some green veggies I'll be trying to eat healthy or whatever so um broccoli and green beans and then the um slaw and fish I didn't put that much in these tacos but it really didn't need much it's pretty good so I'm gonna eat this real quick don't judge my cooking skills I'm a bad bleep, not a chef, okay? Mm. Mm, 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 mm. <sighs> mm. It was mid. Mission accomplished. Woo! We ate. Hydrated a little, and now we are on our way back to class. I'm not gonna lie, I do kind of plan for my schedule to be like set up so that I could come home and take a break, but it definitely won't be like on this scale, you know, of like literally running, literally running down the stairs, literally screaming at traffic. But 
we made it and this um journalism teacher i don't remember exactly what class it is i need to like get familiar with my schedule <laughs> but um she better deliver okay she better deliver because that's on period let's get to class let's go to school mm -mm. school we're gonna see how these night classes treat me i'm a little scared or whatever I'm a little scared or whatever. Have I been back here before? Yeah. I'm a college girl. Thought I knew where I was going, you thought wrong, babe. Okay, so today, let me see if I can find this room real quick. Yeah, I don't even think I'm nowhere near. I know I'm in the right building, but I'm on the opposite side. Okay, so that was the room that I was supposed to be going into. Ooh, I got the phone all in the camera. Um, I'm early, which I guess I rushed so hard for no reason. Rushed so hard for no reason. But yeah, this like little brown building is basically gonna be my home for like the next few years. So I'm excited. Now these classes, they cute or whatever, but I'm ready to get back there with the cameras, like with the big cameras. I'm gonna see if I can like insert a clip right here. Basically it was like, I, I guess it was like a newsroom with like cameras and like, it just felt right. I don't know how to describe it, but it felt right. So I'm gonna be in front of the cameras like, oh, I'm Shanae. No, I'm playing. Alrighty, I think people walked in class. So here we go. Okay, so I'm in my car. I'm doing my last class for today. It is a night class. Um, it was supposed to end at like 9.20, but we got done at like 8.20. He just kind of let us go early. It's like the first day. Nobody cares about anything. our first day of school you guys um i'm not gonna lie i'm tired like it honestly it's earlier in the night but i have to say i'm tired like i got up so early this morning i could have done a little bit better with like the timing of things but it's my first day and like i didn't know where things were stuff like that so whatever but um 
yeah i just wanted to like talk to you guys real quick about how i thought my first day went um i like the vibe of ucf it gives like it gives me kind of like vacation vibes like just kind of like easy going vibes like i don't know i just felt like a positive vibe when i was there um it campus is huge like the library itself really had me like you know and the library is going to be like kind of my second home because some of my classes are online so um yeah the library was huge like it was really huge i don't know how to describe this <laughs> um what am i trying to say when i like i just expected it to be more I expected the students to be more uppity than they were and I'm glad that they weren't you know what I mean but right before the semester started I was just kind of second-guessing where I, whether I should even go to a PWI because I didn't want to have like the same experience as I had in high school where like the kids were just so rich and I just kind of just felt like it was just me myself and I had to be honest you know so I don't know I just was expecting to see people like I was just expecting to see money, to be honest. Like, I was really expecting to see money. But, like, I really just saw, like, a diverse, a really diverse group of, like, students and just, like, people that were trying to make it through college like I am. So I just, I don't know, I feel, like, relieved that I won't be feeling as outcasted there as I have in other places like high school. Um, but yeah, like I just was expecting to see like just uppity people, like not, I don't know, like I knew UCF was diverse, but I just was still kind of like, uh, you know, it ain't an HBCU, don't get me wrong, because I consider going to fam, like let's not get that twisted, but I love Orlando so much that I'm like, okay, whatever, I'm gonna finish my last two years at UCF, and if I want to keep playing around with school, then maybe fam, but I'm probably gonna like get my degree in skedaddle. I really enjoyed my night class. I'm tired today because I got up so early. I know I said that a hundred times, but I did enjoy my night class. And like my professor was like, he was funny. He was funny. Like it was giving personality. And I love that with people because like, that's how I am. I'm just kind of like jokey, goofy, like whatever. So like, I appreciate like having a professor like that. Um, I did for a second kind of start questioning like the field that I'm going into. When the professor was kind of talking about what journalism was, part of me like questioned it, but part of me is like, I've seen people do what I want to do and they have a journalism degree. So I was just kind of like, and then like, just like the salary range just kind of had me in a chokehold like, mm, like do I really want to put myself through school and put myself through everything for no income no like if the outcome is not income literally what is the point there's no point like you can't even survive off of all your hard work you know what i'm saying so i just don't know and like i don't really see there being a significant like price increase than where i am now with like serving at top off you know what i mean like i don't want to take a pay cut doing my future job I, like that doesn't make any sense you know so i don't really know um i feel like this is the age to not know so i don't know I, I i don't know i don't know this lady's name but i could like put it up on the screen whenever i find her she like conducts reunions for like love and hip-hop or like just being a person that conducts reunions for reality tv you know like something like that i do want to do something with entertainment so i don't know if i should change it from journalism to something with like more focus on entertainment or stay where i am you know it's just like confusing like these days i don't know nothing i don't like i just don't know nothing like i don't know but I feel like this is the age to not know, you know what I mean? But I don't want to be changing my major 300 million, quadrillion thousand times. Like, I'm good on that. I'm so good on that. Even when I look through, like, the classes that we take for the degree, I'm interested in the classes, you know what I mean? And if it's not journalism, then what? You know what I mean? Other than, like, actually creating videos or, like, um, being an influencer type of deal or, like, a reality TV person like some like other than being the entertainer i don't see myself doing anything other than journalism you know what i mean i don't know we got more content coming up you guys and I, this is like what i look like currently but you're gonna be seeing videos where i look a little different that is because the videos are like older but like i felt it would be good content to still put up 
So yeah, we're like getting back into the groove of, you know, videos and being on YouTube and being on TikTok and do, you know what I mean? So yeah, thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend she's back. It's 2023, I wanna make more videos. I wanna get to the bag, I wanna finish school. And I hope to document that. I will document that. I don't wanna be like wishy-washy with videos. It does nothing for me. So anyway, thank you guys for watching and I will hang out with you guys on my next video. Bye.